Dear Heavenly Father, we come to you, Father God. 
Father God, you know all about it. Just continue to bless us through this service. Keep us strong, Heavenly Father. Bless all those who can travel to the service, to the service be safe. And bless us the same service. Bless us the same route as we leave the service and go home. Continue to bless all the mother and fathers who take care of their kids every day in the school. And bless the bus drivers who come to meet the mother and keep them safe. Reach out to the homeless. Reach out to the hospitals. Reach out to all of those, Father God. Maybe not doing as well as we are, but we know, Father God, that you are in control. Reach your hand over there in Ukraine, in Russia, in Africa.
Prince Chapel will come and give us their open so they this time. Receive them with a hand clap of praise.
I place a demand on my seed. And by faith receive. Lost souls in. In open heaven. Earth divinely invaded. Storehouse unlocked. Miracles created. Declarations. Visitations. And divine manifestations. Positions and promotions. Loans approved. Debt removed. Marriages and restored marriages.
He didn't go out to Walmart and Target and do like we normally do without being nervous. Your, ner your nerves is a wreck. And some of us, we just, when we get by certain folks, we just a nervous wreck. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you get around some family because you're a nervous wreck. Come up in God's house and you still a nervous wreck. And God has not given now one of us. Spirit of you.
but let's not take that, let's not take that lightly. When you don't see people that you have normally see, call or check on them. Don't wait for the pastor or the deacon or somebody. You got a phone, you pick it up, and you call them and check on them. Amen. And open up your mouth of compassion. Amen. So uh, if there's any other reminders that need to be sent out, uh, we will um, uh, get it to you via email. All right, that's enough of that. Those are our reminders. Know yourself according to that information. We're so glad to have the doctor. Clifton E. Harris with us on the test. Thank you. 
Amen. All of you, my father's children. Amen. It's just good to be here. All right, we're not going to labor time. So, Prince Chapel, I'm going to just hold up and say one, two, three, four, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight, nine. Five. How many songs that you all desire to come back with? The next voice that we hear through my way of preaching will be that of Dr. Harris. If you're ready to receive the word of God, say, Lord.
forever in that yeah. church say amen. 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 But did all the people say amen? Amen. amen. To yes, <laughs> And uh, we're going to be 
get out of here. Amen. Amen. All right. Um, why did you stand? Amen. Y'all keep that bad on. It's all over here. I smell some food over here. And I know we see, we see some people over there in the fellowship hall. I'm with you. But we're going to be together in a minute. And, uh, all right. If you turn with me and Luke. Probably heard this before, Luke, the 15th chapter, and uh, we're going to begin with the uh, 11th verse. Luke uh, 15 and 11. Again, thank you, Kawhi. You sung real beautifully. Thank you. God bless you. Amen. All right, when you find that, just say amen. Amen. All right, and he said that a certain man have two sons, and the youngest of them said unto the father, Father, give me the portion of good that falleth unto me. Back up uh, unto them his living. And not many days after the younger son gathered all together and took a journey into a far country, and there awaits his substance with righteous living. And when he had spent all, there arose a mighty famine in the land and began to be in want. And he went and joined himself a citizen of that country, and he sent him into the field to feed the swine. And he would fain, fan, in other words, he was hungry, have filled his belly with the husk that the swine did eat, and no man gave unto him. And when he came to himself, he said, How many I servant of my father have bread enough and to spare? And I, I, and I'm I, perishing with hunger. Amen? Amen? And number 18, I will rise and go to my Father, now, it don't say house, but it says, I go to my father, and I will say to my father, Father, I have sinned against heaven and before thee. So I'm going to leave it right there. Amen? Amen. Amen. You see, um, I want to uh, talk about uh, go back home. Amen. Uh, since it's homecoming, amen, I want to talk about uh, go back home. Uh, we see in the word of God that Jesus talking, giving this parable about loss. Lost coin, amen, and some other uh, lost sheep. But here he talked about a man that had two sons. Um, this 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 man uh, house might be in order in terms of he served God, he loved God, but there's some rules and regulation uh, in the house that the boys uh, uh, had to follow. Because if you keep reading, uh, his brother was out there somewhere in the field, but here is the younger boy. Amen. Somehow another woke up one morning. Amen. Uh, decided to tell the old man, uh, I know you're not dead, but whatever you got in store for me, I want it now. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all ain't talking to me. Uh, uh, I know I'm in the wheel, and uh, I can't wait to whatever money you have for me, I want it now. Yeah. Y'all ain't hear me that. Uh, somebody at the school said, I look pretty good. I got a nice bicep. I got muscle. I got good hair, wavy hair. And I look pretty good. And uh, uh, you, 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 you ought to be on your own. Amen. I know your mom and dad go to church. Amen. Uh, I know they know the golden rule. Amen. Uh, a family that prays together stays together. Uh, somehow, love, you need to break away. Amen. And find you another place but with your daddy money. Uh, somehow, mother, I don't know how this young man came up to his daddy, uh, Pastor Carl, to ask him, his daddy, uh, to give him the money to his son that his son didn't work for. Amen. But yet, he wants some money. Come on, can I get with this? Uh, let me bring it down this way. I would never ask my mom and daddy to give me damn money in such an arrogance and an attitude. Oh, if, they, if I did, I wouldn't be preaching today. All I say is that, amen. Because you just didn't come to old people or older folks uh, disrespectful. Amen. You can't Do you have any money? Oh, wow. But now we see in this generation, kids tell their parents oh, wow. what they want. Oh, wow. uh, they this call. Many parents, and I told you, we said, I, 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 me and my daughter are uh, the like sister. Oh, wow. uh, 
being my children or friend. No, no, you got to understand you are the parents. And they are the children.
Oh, 
Yeah. 
and then I'm drop a half a gallon of oil on you, and next week you still have to let the devil come in the back of in you. So when you ask God to forgive you, you are forgiven. Have you been here? When you pray right, God will work it out. Can I get a witness? All you have to do is get your heart right. Can I get a witness?
Let's listen to it tonight. You have to go through the trials and tribulations. You have to go through the testing times. But God gives you an inner strength. Anybody know what I'm talking about? When God strengthens the inner man. May God move you from the apartment to the mansion. But it gives you strength in the inner man.
together or nothing. And I, y'all know you that are living in Holly Springs. No, I'm not telling a lie. The only time we come together is on you. Yeah. We talk about how much we love each other. The only time we see each other when somebody laying out in front of the church. Saints, we got to come together without the view. So I say it to you. First Baptist. Mangles here. We got Sister Rosa that's here. You not a church of Christ, did you? Yeah, I'm gonna call by stuff. Trust me. <laughs> Sister Edna, these Ebenezer, Providence. Who else is here in here? Old Rome, I don't care what these other churches do. We will fellowship. All right. Yes, 
And it is 036. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
our blessing as we leave this place today. Oh God, we ask you to help us to be the Christian that you want us to be.